it was uh, very important that today we uh, we achieve those points. We are very glad that we uh, uh, we were capable of doing it because after the such a defeat and after the let's say moment where we are now close to an end, it was very important that today we perform and today we uh, try to have a clean sheet and try to score a goal, of course, for uh, this victory. We uh, we showed so far this season that for us the most difficult games were against the teams from a uh, bottom table. Even if I think that our tonight's opponent uh, does not, uh, let's say, uh, deserve to be uh, at the bottom because uh, they can play nice football, they have some uh, interesting players. But anyway, we were on uh, top of our possibilities tonight. We scored on a set piece, which was the uh, the thing that we were uh, we've been working in the uh, last couple of days. Uh, it was very important that we tonight uh, mentally stay strong, that we uh, stay focused, concentrating, especially when we are about to defend uh, set pieces. Uh, then it was very important that we get a clean sheet, uh, that we stay organized in the moment when we were suffering, and then trying to uh, maybe break and uh, create some more chances to score uh, more goals, which we had tonight. On the other side, the opponents, they had also a couple of chances. It was, uh, it was a difficult game. From uh, many aspects, it was a difficult game. Now we are entering the period where uh, many teams are fighting for points. Many teams will be more organized, more disciplined in order to achieve those points because we are clo close to an end and especially for the teams fighting for a top table it will be like that. Yes, absolutely. I think that uh, from the uh, seeing the first half we were the team who were pressing more, who, uh, who maybe wanted more uh, and were pushing more in the first half. Uh, in the second half we wanted to stay strong, we wanted to start very strong with, uh, with the pressure in the second half, which resulted uh, with the corner kick uh, after which we scored uh, our, uh, our, own, uh, our goal. And then after that, we, uh, we kind of uh, lost the grip, lost the control of, uh, of a midfield. But anyway, we stayed organized, we stayed focused. Even we had, uh, in one period later on, the control of the ball, uh, conserving the ball around, uh, passing the ball around, trying to create uh, more chances. Uh, but anyway, at the end we are happy, we are glad uh, because now we are entering, like I said, at the last phase, the last uh, two weeks where many teams will be fighting for, uh, for points, where many things will be decided and where uh, we have to stay focused, organized because we will be facing now top teams, we will have uh, direct duels and actually uh, we will have to be ready for that. Well, actually we would like him to play the entire game. Uh, the fact that we uh, at one moment wants to change our uh, winger position and the fact that when we are following all the GPS uh, things see that uh, he runs a lot, he completes kilometers and uh, when we see that he is at the end of his uh, possibilities, not only him but many other players, then we have to make decision. It's about uh, coaching staff decision uh, to make those things and actually tonight uh, if you if you saw, we had three goalkeepers on the bench. We had only five players. We didn't have not the one defender on the bench. We didn't have not the one fullback on the bench. The only thing, the only guys on the bench were two central midfielders and uh, let's say three wingers. So, and then when you are uh, when you have that kind of situation, you have to puzzle. You have to to change something. And uh, also speaking of uh, the fact that our defense line, complete defense line tonight, played for the very first time together since we started, it was, uh, it was not quite easy for, uh, for the team. And I'm very glad that we, uh, we had this clean sheet tonight. They were marvelous. So, you know, Sahal is a great player. He has to continue working hard because the things that he's giving to, the team is, to, to our team is, are great. Well, uh, all of these young boys, they have to face uh, difficult and uh, different moments uh, during ISL. So it's not uh, just going onto the pitch, playing nice football, smiling, having fun. Sometimes it's uh, it's like a fight. You have to enter duels, and I'm very glad that the many of our young players they are now witnessing and they are now playing uh, these kind of games in uh, ISL because these kind of games will make them stronger. These kind of games will make them better. So like that they improve. This is kind of confirmation of their uh, qualities, character, mentality, because if they want to participate in this kind of league, they should be strong and they have to continue working hard to, uh, to be there. So I'm very glad about him. I'm very glad about all the youngsters. We were missing a couple of them uh, tonight, but anyway, we still have, uh, I think, one of the young, uh, youngsters team in, uh, in the league. Many of them completed many minutes. Uh, this season and we'll continue to do it so till the till the last game. Well, Bejo is a, is a great guy, he's a good player, 
since uh, he started training with us uh, last August, he was coming from a B team. Uh, he never played uh, on, on the level of ISL and now completing a couple of games this season and showing uh, quality, maturity, showing uh, uh, great mentality, uh, fighting spirit. So this is something extra that uh, he will bring also in the future uh, to Kerala Blasters. He has to work a lot, he has to continue improving. There are many aspects in his game and many other youngsters uh, that they have to uh, improve, they have to uh, correct. That's why we are here. I'm really glad to have all of them. I'm really glad and it's my big pleasure to, to work with them and uh, try to improve them even more.